Yo, what's going on? It's Brahma, and in this video, we're going to go through more sounds inside the Ape Shit synth. So right now, we still have the pads, we have the synths, and we have the plugs to go through. Starting off with the pads, I have the all-in-all -all pads loaded up right now. This is the first pad bank inside of it. You can hear how fluffy, futuristic, and how wonderful that sounds. Right? Sounds very, very atmospheric. So we're gonna go to the next one, Black Rain Pads. Very bell, bell-like. Right? Blissful pads. As you hear, there's a sound in the background blended in the pads that's going from left to right. And the wonderful thing about the pads is that you could simply turn the attack down and you get a, a synth sound all in itself. So there's a lot you could do to customize these sounds and make them sound different than, than how they are in the presets. Blue Comet Pads. Right, very airy. Sounds like you're floating on clouds. And like I said, once I shorten the attack, it turns into a synth. Right, and then we can turn it right back into a pad. And you could do this with the other sounds in here too. So that's what I love about this machine, is that it's simple to tweak sounds from one, from, um, from one natural, um, what do I wanna say, from its natural sound into a different sound. So, the, like I said, this pad could become a synth, and the synth could become a pad just by the flip of one knob or a fader. So, electro pads. Very floaty. You could make a, you could make a nostalgic 80s track with this. Elohim pads. Very heavenly. Very, very, very atmospheric sounding. And we're gonna go through these, this last one, and then we're gonna go through some of the, the synths. Fireworks pads. Very different. You've never heard pads like these before, I promise you. Okay, so that's what you get with Ape Shit Synth Pads. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and go to the next bank, which is going to be the synths. So the synths here, we got the Asteroid Synth. This is the first one that, that's loaded up. Sounds like a telephone almost. Like if you were trying to call, if E.T. was phoning home, that's what it would sound like, right? Right, then Bruno, Bruno 7 synth. This is probably my favorite synth. Sounds like something Parliament would use. Bernie Warrell. These were all custom designed, handcrafted sounds. You won't find these presets in any other synthesizer, I promise you. Okay, now we're gonna go through the cyborg synth. And like I said, we can simply because this one's mono, we could simply make it polyphonic and, and uh, raise the attack. 
and it becomes a pad. Put the release out. Okay, so then we got the ether synth. And this is monophonic. We could, we could make it polyphonic. Play chords with it. Okay. And EWF synth. Right, and let's go through one more synth, Goonie synth. Right, crazy. So that gives you an idea of some of the crazy, insane, dope, out of this world synths that are in this synthesizer and that's only number like six that we went to there's 20 different ones let's go through one more solomon synth crazy imagine making a beat with that and this is going to give you the advantage and edge over the competition because there's no synthesizer with crazy synths that sound like these already pre-programmed and we're not even, we haven't even went into trying to um, manipulate them and make them sound any different than how they naturally come. So we're in the plugs bank now and we're going to go through this pretty quickly. There's 20 different plugs. Uh, Andromeda plug is the first one. Let me turn that up a little bit for you. Almost sounds like a synthesizer, um, a clav kind of. It has a clav and a harpsichord feel to it. This one's the Archon Pluck. Very, very dope, okay. And Astro Pluck. Right. Bootsy Pluck. Crazy. Okay, and then dopamine pluck. This has a, like a bell resonance to it. Right, and then the whole tip pluck. Okay, pretty dope. Isis Pluck. That's crazy. And if you dare, you could use this as a bass, as you can hear. It has enough bottom end on it to carry a, a bass line. Okay, and one more pluck and Juno pluck and just to give you an idea. So that's pretty much all we're gonna go through in the plucks. That's about seven or eight plucks we just went through. So you get an idea of what you're getting in the ape shit synth with these sound banks. Crazy. If you want to take your beats to that next level out of this world into the cosmos, ape shit synth is the VST plugin that you want in your arsenal. Okay? So download it ASAP. See you next time. Peace, love, and beats. 
And I hope you enjoy it. Make some bangers. Let us know how you feel about it.